This here is one kick-ass motorcycle. The 2022 Ducati Multistrada V4 Pikes Peak that isn't just a Multistrada that has a different paint job. Ducati really decided to make this a different motorcycle. So, of course, at the heart of it is the 1158cc Gran Turismo V4 engine. Makes 170 horsepower, 92 foot-pounds of torque. But for the Pikes Peak model, because this is inspired by the Pikes Peak Multistrada that won the Pikes Peak race in 2010. Ducati introduced the ride modes concept back in 2010, and the Multistradas typically have four modes. It would be sport, touring, urban, and enduro. But since this is the Pikes Peak, it has a new mode called race that replaces enduro. And the race mode really enhances the aggressive performance that you would want for a bike like this. So what the ride modes do is they adjust engine output, throttle response, cornering ABS, cornering traction control. This is the first Multistrada to have the Olin's Smart EC 2.0 event-based semi-active suspension. It also is, again, as a premium motorcycle, it has, uh, starting in the front, it's got radar that is for adaptive cruise control. It's got a rear radar for blind spot detection. Lights light up in the mirrors when there's somebody in your blind spot. It has a Kropovich pipe it's got 17 inch wheels. They're forged Marchesini wheels that shave an entire, almost nine pounds of unsprung weight off of this motorcycle versus other Multistratas. The engine has all the power you would want, but it really, it's very smooth and responsive. Even in the race and sport modes, it's very direct throttle response, but it's not too aggressive. It's not abrupt. And this thing, again, with the 17 inch wheels, the light wheels, it handles really well. It's very smooth in the corners. The Brembo Stylema calipers up front, they pinch huge 330 millimeter discs and they're absolute fantastic brakes. So again, this is the new top of the line Multistrada. It's 28,995 is the MSRP and it really has everything that you would want. About the only thing it didn't have today, we were riding, it was pretty cold, is they have accessory heated grips, which we had those today, but it's got hangers for saddlebags. It's got a rear rack that you could put a trunk on. And even though the ergonomics are a little bit more aggressive or you know sport oriented than a regular Multistrada V4, this is a bike that is, is actually really comfortable. I'd load it up, I'd put my wife on the back, I'd go all day, all weekend, it'd be fantastic. Another thing is that whereas the Multistrada V4s typically have a two-sided swing arm, They've got a single-sided swing arm on this bike. It's a little bit longer to give it some more stability, but overall, an absolute fantastic motorcycle. It was a great ride. We'll have a full review on ridermagazine.com. We'll have it in the magazine. Uh, thanks for watching.